po ba kayo ng karelasyon? Oo. Oh. Ilang taon kayo? Tatlong taon. Anong dahilan ba kayo nagkahiwala? Kasi, tatlong taon na expect siya sa akin. Para sa'yo, mahalaga ba ang pakikipagtalik sa isang relasyon? Ano dapat ang baguhin sa iyong sarili? Dapat maging confident yan. Ano pa po? Siwala. So tingin mo, hadlang ba ang kahirapan sa isang relasyon? Bakit? Ano po sa walang pa yung maratang sa puno siya? So dito sa story, nagkahiwalay sila dahil sa hirap ng buhay na which is my point naman. Kasi hindi naman po palagi yung pwedeng pusa at pagmamahalang yung pinapairal. Kasi syempre, dapat iisipin mo rin yung magiging future mo, magiging future nyo pag naging nagkapamilya na kayo. So, hindi ko naman sinasabi na kailangan hanapin mo yung taong meron na kagad lahat. Okay, hindi naman ganun eh. Pwede nyo naman gawin yon pareho na maging successful. Basta gawin yung inspirasyon yung pagmamahalan nyo. Pero, ang pinakamaganda dun is habang wala pa, habang nag explore ka pa lang at nag enjoy ng life, na big, being na single, is nagbe-build up ka na, naghahanda ka na para once na dumating yung taong hinahanap mo is meron ka, hindi ka mapapahiya sa magulang, hindi siya magda-doubt na kung anong kaya mo ibigay sa kanya kasi alam mo, bago pa siya dumating, nagre-ready ka na eh. So, para sa akin, yun po yung pinakamagandang gawin. So, yung moral lesson dito is hindi lang puro dapat pagmamahal na-prioritize. Kailangan isipin mo rin yung magiging future. Siguro, the moral lesson I learned from the story is na to trust too much. Tapos, magtira tayo ng love para sa sarili natin. Huwag natin ibigay lahat. Nakatulad ng ginawa ni Isabel. Kay Joe, binigyan niya lahat, pero hindi rin sila nagkatuluyan. Tapos, know our priorities. And matuto tayo makontento kung anong, kung anong meron tayo. At work hard para makamit natin yung mga bagay na gusto pa natin. The story most important lesson is to be not impulsive. We should not act just because of the situation of our emotion but a wise judgment. It is important to slow down once in a while. Rushing doesn't do anything good but to stress you and the people around you because of the stupid mistakes that you make. Lastly, when in rush, we, to, we tend to focus on the ourselves. So learn to pose, always choose to have a wise judgment. And the moral of the story is that we should not rush into, into things. Nowadays, as a millennia, we are pressured to do things that our peers normally do. We should not give into the temptation that are around us. And we have to think a thousand times before we act. Sometimes, uh, we are carried away by the intense situation, but but we have to be firm on our ground and stand on what we believe, what's moral and right. We should be responsible in our action because it will affect our future. Kung sa cost price na story ay hindi hadlang ang kahirapan sa isang relasyon para kayo ay maghiwalay, subukan nyo gumawa ng paraan para, para matugunan nyo yung responsibility nyo sa partner nyo at huwag kayo basta-basta mag-give up dahil lang sa kulang kulang ang financial uh, maging maging mata So the moral lesson here in the story is first dapat mayroon lang tayo mag-appreciate kung ano man yung status sa buhay ng taong mahal natin. It's not a basis kung Mahirap yung taong mahal natin, iiwan na natin. Because it's not about the future. Kasi kung mahal nyo naman talaga yung isa't isa, pwede nga magtulungan in order to survive. Your, and ma 
tampasan nyo yung problem nyo. And when it comes sa decision making, dapat pinag-iisipan natin ito ng maayos. Kasi may mga decision na sa bandang huli ay pinagsisisihan natin. Uh, the story most important lesson is to be not impulsive. Uh, we should we should not act just because of the situation or emotion, but with wise judgment. Uh, lastly, when in rush, we tend to focus only on ourselves to learn, to pause, breath, and think. Always choose to have a wise judgment and never rush. For the moral lesson, love is not about the material things or your money. Love is about how much you accept a person in your life who loves you unconditionally, even the small things or your money that he or she can give to you. You don't need to make an effort to express how much you love them, because if they really wanna be with you and be with you, they will cause they love you need 